While testing India's own operating system before the media, Union Electronics and IT Minister Ashwini Vaishnav on Tuesday said that it was a work in progress and a step in the right direction. With Union Education Minister Dharmendra Pradhan by his side, Vaishnav also warned of challenges that this indigenous OS may face. People don't want any system like this to succeed. So we have to be very careful, very cautious, very persistent. Continuously we'll have to keep working on making it successful. Bhar OS is based on Android open source project AOSP, making it a forked version of Android Sans Google and other first party and third party apps. Developed by Jan DK, Operations Private Limited, which is a non-profit organization incubated at IIT Madras, it doesn't have any default app. Developers claim that it will offer a more secure and private platform compared to existing operating systems. Absence of any default app means that the control rests with the users and they can install apps of their choice. According to IIT Madras, this approach would allow users to have more control over the permissions that apps have on their device, as they can choose to allow apps that they trust to access certain features or data on their device. This is also in tune with the steps that the Indian government has been taking for a while. Google is finally working with mobile device makers to unbundle the distribution of Play Store, which is linked to the current policy, where the latter have no option but to pre-install a suite of around nine leading apps on their devices. Bhar OS gives access to trusted apps from organization-specific private app store services or PaaS. In the PaaS, Bhar OS provides access to a curated list of apps that have met certain security and privacy standards of organizations. Only the apps checked for any potential security vulnerabilities or privacy concerns are listed in the PaaS for users to install on their mobile devices. Bhar OS gets native over-the-air updates to ensure that the supported devices get the latest version of the operating system. In the words of Professor V. Kamakoti, Director IIT Madras, Bhar OS service is a mobile operating system built on a foundation of trust with a focus on providing users more freedom, control and flexibility to choose and use only the apps that fit their needs. This innovative system promises to revolutionize the way users think about security and privacy on their mobile devices. The operating system is currently being provided to organizations that have stringent privacy and security requirements. IIT Madras is set to have plans to work closely with private industry, government agencies, strategic agencies and telecom service providers to increase the usage and adoption of Bhar OS in the country. For consumers, Bar OS is expected to bring a flexible experience that neither Google Android and Apple iOS offer in their current form. It is because Google Android is heavily dependent on Google services and Apple iOS is a walled garden. Both Google and Apple justify their approach by citing concerns from users' privacy and security perspective. It is yet to be seen how Bar OS does on this front. If you like this video, share it and subscribe to Business Standard. For more news, views and insights, log on to www.business-standard.com. Do also follow us on YouTube, Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, Telegram and LinkedIn.